A cry of pain now that may save this child's life later on. Ghana has become the world's first nation to approve an anti-malaria vaccine after decades of research. The vaccine, developed by British pharmaceutical company GSK, is thought to be nearly 80 percent effective in trials, though data has yet to be widely published and the World Health Organization has not officially approved the drug. That fact adds to the watershed. Generally speaking, the WHO approves such vaccines before national governments and rich countries before poorer ones. But after a botched COVID rollout that saw African nations last in line, Ghana isn't leaving things to chance. There's a good reason for that. Malaria kills over half a million children annually, with the vast majority of those deaths inside Africa. So far, Ghana has only approved the new vaccine for children five months to three years old, the most vulnerable to the disease. But while a step in the right direction, experts warn against overestimating the development of the vaccine. The scale of malaria, combined with funding and distribution questions, means the battle against the disease will likely continue for years. Priyanka Navani, TRT World.